I tried this Abe here, it's Friday, uh, after lunch, and uh, today we've seen some buying up of gold, uh, three four hour candles, uh, all kicked off by comments made by um, Fed Member Williams, I believe. Um, it's not a lot of information online as to why uh, the US dollar fell and gold rose. Um, hopefully that didn't trigger anybody to put in some trades. Um, try and avoid being reactionary to sudden price movement. Um, in this case, it's the the um, upper buying has ceased. Uh, you'll see that on the hourly. We've had an hour of, um, uh, I guess, a small a small doji, um, and I expect that to come down uh, after four and trade down into this evening, being the last night of the week. Uh, it's an interesting situation in that we have filled over a 31 day period uh, a wedge and we are basically at the point of the wedge um, and I see the long term diagonal wedge line as resistance and um, so Tonight should be interesting and next week should be quite interesting as well to um, see a new trend starting, which will be awesome. So then we can start making some profit again, get out of this uh, nasty consolidation retraction uh, pattern and, um, and become traders again, become profitable traders again. Uh, We've needed a fair bit of patience for a good deal of time and of course that uh, builds pressure in people and uh, creates impatience so you know the longer you trade the more you'll discover that um, patience goes a long way. Um, it'll be the difference between having losing trades which could be very large or profitable trades which also, also could be very large. So let's see what happens tonight, being Friday night, end of the training week. Uh, I'll make a video tomorrow and I'll talk to you guys on Tuesday. Cheers.